Hi there, this is the kitchen sink trap and it's in the Max Lang attack in the Two Knights Defence in which white throws everything at black including, as the phrase goes, the kitchen sink. e4 and e5, knight f3 attacking e5 and knight c6 defending, bishop c4 and knight f6, the two knights defence. White goes for d4. Grandmaster Zilberman is adamant that this is white's best move. After e takes on d4, white castles, and after black now defends the pawn on d4 with the bishop, bishop to c5, now white pushes e5. The counter thrust in the center is common here by black, d5 hitting the bishop, and e takes on f6, d takes on c4, allows the rook to enter into the game with rook e1 hitting the king. Black's going to interpose bishop e6, all uh, solid theory at the moment, and knight g5 targeting that bishop. So queen d5 defends everything, but does allow white to develop knight c3 with uh, a tempo on the queen, because d takes on c3 will allow queen takes on d5, since the bishop on e6 is pinned by the rook on e1. So queen f5 is played here and now white throws g4 into the mix, hitting the queen and this is where black makes a very common mistake by capturing the pawn on f6. Mandatory here was queen to g6 where black can certainly hold. If instead queen takes on f6, it's actually game over after knight d5 hits hitting the queen. And when the queen runs back to d8 to keep an eye on c7, then white can sacrifice. A common sacrificial theme in the Max Lang is a sacrifice on e6. This time it's rook takes on e6. Since after f takes on e6 and knight takes on e6, those knights are really menacing. The queen cannot capture the knight on d5 because knight takes on c7, check will pick up the queen. Meanwhile, the queen is being targeted by that knight on e6. So the queen is going to have to move queen d7. And here white would certainly win with a knight on d5 taking the pawn on c7, maybe king f7 and then knight g5 white is certainly winning inferior to knight takes on c7 but certainly very tempting which leaves white still in the driving seat is queen e2 so we're going to look at this line now after queen e2 black should play king f7 and can still battle on if instead black tries to close the e-file and also get the bishop out of harm's way since it was being targeted by the knight on c5 if bishop e7, then we got knight d takes on c7, check. After king f7, now queen takes on c4. And there's obviously a discovered check in the air with that knight perhaps threatening to uh, maybe knight c5, which will hit the queen on d7. So knight e e5 hitting the white queen, which simply plays a quiet move, queen b3. Queen d6 is played here. Perhaps better might have been king to g6, but that would have allowed knight f4, where white is winning. And if instead king to f6, then the bishop on c1 jumps into to the game with bishop g5 check. If king here to g6, white can even give up the bishop on g5 by playing knight f4 hitting the king happily giving up that bishop on g5. So going back after queen d6 here, white could play bishop f4. That's definitely going to be killing. Or could go for this line f4, which is quite pretty. And now we'll see how the game concludes. If knight takes on g4, now knight g5 check. King g6 and queen d3 check again. The king is not going to be able to go to h6 because then we've got knight to f7 check queen. The king really is out of squares. If king to f6, then knight to e4 is check picking up the queen. So king to h5 
allows queen h3 and after king g6 white could continue with f5 probably white's best move here but can also play queen takes on g4 that's also adequate and now the threat is uh, moving the knight again another discovered attack the knight may be threatening knight e4 hitting the queen again the queen cannot take the knight on c7 because of knight e6 which is going to be discover check and picking up the queen again so black here is busted if black runs with the queen queen b6 then knight g e6 discover check after king f6 queen g5 check forcing king f7 and queen takes on g7 is checkmate so this has been the kitchen sink trap in the max lang attack of the two knights thanks for watching bye bye